thank you. How was that for a great children's show? They're wonderful. They come every year. They practice. They have a big competition in Columbia, and they come here and present their show. And now something very special that we're going to do is announce the winners of our student and emerging designer competitions that we have been running on the website for the last several months. We've had entries from all over the world, and many of the winners and the finalists have joined us here tonight. And also, to present the awards, we have the judges. The first award that we have is the Emerging Women's Wear Designer. And that's the judge is Mercedes Gonzalez, the president of Global Purchasing Group. And she's from New York. She's been one of our judges for many, many years. I just want to say how difficult it was to make this decision. There was a tremendous amount of talent this year with the emerging designer. And I have a lot of respect for the emerging designer because they are really the future of our industry. They're the hardest working. It's very okay. difficult to, to uh, break into the business. And um, they, they are the future. And one piece of advice I want to give the emerging designers, look at the future. Don't look at the past. We've already done the 50s and the 60s and the 70s and the 80s and the 90s. I want to see something new. I want to see innovation. And I think part of that secret is going to be in the technologies of fabric. So today, I want to congratulate Carolina Benat from the United States. Congratulations. She is our emerging designer winner. Right. Carolina, it is my pleasure to present to you the Emerging Designer Award. Thank you so much. Thank you. You're very welcome. I'm very honored. <laughs> um, thank you so much. I'm very honored. I'm very, very thankful for Miami Fashion Week. This is a great opportunity for us. We need recognition, especially in Miami. Um, and thank you to my mom and my husband <laughs> for supporting me always, and my photographer who has been next to me during this long journey. So. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Thank Congratulations. Thank you, Mercedes. All right, our next award is the jewelry designer. And we have our judge is Esther Suede, who's a metalsmith and jewelry designer and the uh, director of the City of Hollywood yes. and Miami International University of Art Design professor. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Beth. Thank you very much. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It is a pleasure for me to present today the winner for the Jewelry Award. It was really hard for me to choose between all these wonderful designs that all these kids made. Uh, I have to judge between the creativity, the craftsmanship, and the final product. And it's a pleasure for me to announce the winner is Osnat Arnoy from Israel. It's an honor for me to present this award for you today. I was very impressed with your craftsmanship and your designs. Very well done, and keep the good work. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you so much. I'm so excited. Thank you so much for my family. This is, this is a huge honor for me. Um, and yeah, the ones over here and the ones back home. So thank you so much. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Our next award is the Handbag Designer Award, and this is being presented by Andrew, no, by, I'm sorry, by Robin Fleming. And Robin can tell you all about herself. Well, first of all, Beth, thank you so much for having me back. This is my fifth year with Miami Fashion Week, and I'm really excited to be a judge every year. I have a retail store, La Casa Hermosa, in Wellington, and we do beautiful evening wear and bridal, and I did my bridal line uh, last year at Miami Fashion Week to Queso Couture. So um, there's nothing that goes with a woman's outfit more than a fabulous handbag. And I happen to love this category because it's a personal favorite of mine. And everyone who uh, distributes, contributes, displays, sells handbags knows that it's really, it's such a personal statement for a woman to carry a handbag. So I'm very honored and pleased to announce the winner of this year's award is Mr. Chi Ming, the brand by Joe Lau from Korea. 
Is he in the house? Oh, she in the house, on the other side of the house. Okay. Take it down, walk down. Okay, wonderful. So here you go, congratulations. Would you like to say a few words? Yeah. Oh, actually, the, I'm not Joe, but actually Joe is in Korea right now. So I just came for him. The, I'm actually the, their American representative. The, my name is Ju. We are very honored because the La Palette, we just start to uh, actually the start to build up our brand name the, from the, this January. And the, we are very honored to have a, this awesome gift from you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you for well, being here. Him. He's welcome. <laughs> I hate him. <laughs> Okay. Our next award is the Student Women's Wear Designer. And that is coming from Andrew Bernstein. And Andrew is a very old, dear friend of mine. And I used to model for his grandmother when she had the stores Martha in Palm Beach in New York. Good evening. Is everybody having a great time? Is everybody having a great time? Yeah. Come on. We're here for fashion, right? And Miami Fashion Week, guess what? We're now number one. Right? We're getting up there. So let's hear it for Miami Fashion Week and for Beth Sobel. <laughs> Beth is doing this for the 16th year, and I'm one of her biggest admirers. Yes, my grandmother was a legend in fashion in Florida, New York for 50 years. But you know what? She had a great, great love for Beth, and she would be so thankful for what she's doing today. And you know, I'm giving the award for this student women's wear designer, and I'll do that in one minute. But you know what? Beth and her foundation with Miami Fashion Week for so many years is the leader, really in South Florida, one of the leaders in really able, el enabling students to design, doing fashion, merchandising, jewelry, and so forth. So please, a big amount of applause for Beth and the foundations under Miami Fashion Week. You know what? They are allowing our students and our future students to do what they can. So we really have to thank Beth and her team for doing this for 16 years. So ladies and gentlemen, as an educator and a professor myself for many years, over 20 years, and doing this with Beth for many years, the Student Women's Design Award is a very difficult one. It's really something that you have to be inspired, have a passion for fashion, and obviously having the techniques to put it all together. So, without further ado, Ms. Samantha De La Fuente from Miami International University School of Art and Design is this year's winner. Let's hear it for Samantha. Congratulations, Samantha. It's a great pleasure on behalf of Miami Fashion Week, Ms. Beth Sobel and the whole team to present this to you. And hopefully we're gonna see your designs on all the runways around the world in future years. Thanks and have a great, great future. Thank you Beth? so much. Um, thank you all for being here. Thank you for the opportunity. And I would like to thank my family, my mom, my dad, my brother, and my other family that's back there with me and always supporting me. Thank you all. Thank you. Congratulations. Congratulations. Okay. The next award is our student fashion photographer. And our judge to present the award is Gio Alma, one of our own famous fashion photographers. Hi. Um, I'm going to go back a little bit. I, I know that uh, his brother is around here with a know, camera. Oh, he's got it. <laughs> um, fashion photographer competition. Uh, a lot of submissions, uh, a lot of talent, beautiful photos. Uh, this girl comes from, she comes from the UK, but she's from Poland. And um, she's got a natural talent. I met with her yesterday, and she was saying that uh, she didn't like her photos and that uh, all that kind of stuff that we photographers love because we all feel the same. So, but she's amazing. She's got a great talent and I know that she is going to get far with her fashion photography. Uh, Dominica, Dominica Vosniak, is that correct? Dominica. Look at her dress, wonderful. <laughs> All right, Dominica, a great future to you, and uh, keep up the good work. Oh, my God. Thanks a lot. Thank you very much. Really, good evening, everyone. It's an um, incredible surprise for me to, to arrive from Poland here to Miami, to Miami Fashion Week, and have it surprised. Um, 
especially thanks for you for for this award. And I think uh, I'm a richer, richer. I'm a richer for for the knowledge. I think it's it's more important for me. The knowledge, the knowledge to have it, and for meeting for all of us. Thanks a lot. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. Okay. And our last award this evening is the Student Graphic Artist Award. And the judge for this is Mary Grace McElroy. I'll let Mary Grace come up and uh, tell a little bit about herself. You all right, step up. Yeah. Good evening. Um, before that student photographer disappears, uh, I would like to say that selecting the image that would be used to represent her work in the show book was incredibly difficult because her work has such maturity and refinement, I would expect to see it on the pages of Vogue. It was really tremendous. It was very tremendous. So congratulations, Dominica. I'm Mary Grace McElroy. I'm also a part-time professor at Miami International University of Art and Design, and I have a marketing consulting firm. We've been working with Beth for 15 of her 16 years. I met her by coming down as a journalist um, for the very first Miami Fashion Week. And um, it's truly an honor to continue working with you on this. That being said, um, we had entries into the poster um, competition from all over the world this year. And it was really a surprise and a delight to find that the person who most perfectly captured the feel of Miami, the attitude of the resort wear, um, everything that Miami Fashion Week is about during the resort shows came from a young lady right here who is a Miami native. And it is Nicole Perez from the Academy of Arts and Minds High School. Nicole? You will see these student winners in the uh, show, show book. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. When I found out that I was the only high schooler, I was actually tremendously surprised. And I was like, thank you, God. I didn't think I could do this, but I did. And I would like to thank him and thank my teacher and thank my family and my friends just for the support. And just thank you very much for this award. Nicole, I'm going to hand you a very special, uh, rare, um, award right now, and you may not know people, but this is designed by Tiffany and Company uh, for all of our show winners. So it's um, very befitting that you get this because you are a crystal and a star, and you will go far. Thank you. Thank you very much, everyone. And now the next show is the Jones African American Designer Showcase. See you in a few minutes. <laughs>